bomb that with this. If it reaches eyes. it with a melee and kill it at one. What the hell's that? I don't like it, whatever it is. Hello guys, welcome back to Ark Primal Fear. If you're joining the series, don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment down below on what you'd like to see. Um, today, we're going to be taking out our Celestial Thyla. Now, I did want to try and tame ourselves the next creature up, so that we're going to be kind of prepared for the next tier of bosses, um, which are basically demonic and light creatures. But, we actually are low on a type of resource, and that is the elemental feathers from the different dinos. So I thought, you know what, well, we level up the Thyla, because we will be using her for destroying bosses, we may as well grab these resources and even kill maybe a few more origin bosses, I don't know, we're, we're going to have a look as we're out and about. So we're actually low on electric stuff, so that's what we're going to try and, oh, I'll tell you what, do, we need to reset. Like. So we have an electric feather light out here, so these are the th things that we're probably going to have to go for. As you can see, the dialer shouldn't really have any issues. Love how we can just climb up the, the things with them. Do need to be careful because they do still take fall damage, so So from the training that we did in the last episode, she's doing about six million damage with her primary attack. She's obviously got two an AoE attack and a dot attack, which again can be Quite powerful, but they're not as powerful. What's this? I don't know, but it's dead. The buffoon Megatherium. We obviously don't need to worry about her weight, because she will pretty much just carry anything that we get, really. Is that baby? Oh my god, they're just so small compared to the Thyla that they look like babies. That is ridiculous. Let's just get rid of this. And what's this? This is a demonic. Oh no, it's a Rudolph. Interesting. I heard the noise of something like Celestial about. You ready? Shaboom! If you see any terrible creatures, they're definitely worth killing because they give a lot of loot. Even Malin Turnons apparently give a lot of loot. Right, here we go. Oh, crap. Completely overdid that. Just gotta be careful because I'm pretty sure that. Oh, maybe not. 31 electric feathers, nice. I don't think I'd get that many from a single kill, I'll be honest. But then again, this thing's damages that, like, OP. It probably does affect it. Come on. Aren't these things meant to be able to, like, climb the walls and stuff? Got a level on her anyway, so we'll we'll pump that into her. Um, I'm just gonna send melee. 
don't think we need to really worry about her health. She does that much damage. What was that, that saw down here then? Oh, the uh, Alpha Mega Lacerus. Did I just see that my melee, my melee has jumped up by 1.7 million or something ridiculous? Come on, it's not that difficult to climb a gun hill in this thing, surely? Another one. I think it was. Epic. Pretty sure it should be able to... Oh, there we are. It did it then, but won't do it for some reason, so... I'm seriously missing something here, I think. Oh, there we go. See, did it then. And again. What's this? Noxious Diabo. Didn't know there were Noxious versions of them, I'll be honest. Whoa. Is this one worked him? No. I might be wrong, you know. They might not take fall damage. I just thought they did. And it doesn't look like they do. That's another Rudolph. Oh god. Oh god. I think I've just killed myself. What? No? Apparently not. Ah, I'm invincible. Alright, now I need to get back up there though. That's the problem I've got now. Oh, come on. This game sometimes just plays games with me. Ah, that's why it won't work in. I don't think you're allowed to hold the sprint button while it's climbing. Oh, the game's just broke, basically. Right, well, we've got enough electric ones for now. So, let's find some fire. We need fire and the ice, I think. Basically, it's to create the demonic kibble. Um, You need one of, like, each feather. Fire. Really? Oh no, no, it's fire women. We don't want fire women, we want things like this. So, what I'm going to do here, because I know it's closer, is desert teleporter. Smart move. So, yeah, I think once we've done like a roundup of the feathers, we'll move on to the origin boss killing, because I want to really see how this puts up against the more powerful bosses. Sounds like there's one already around us. Yep, there we are. What is this? Yeah, it's only doing like 60, 70 k to us. What is it? It's a level 200, so it's not like it's anything. No rock break, dead. What the hell is that coming in now? Elemental hide. I got something else off that then. I don't know what it was. Oh my god, is that a secondary? It is as well. There's another origin boss literally just around the corner. I mean, it's mental how much quicker this kills elementals. Elementals, I mean origin bosses. Oh, this guy's definitely a lot more powerful. What is it? Level 380. Shine. We will still kill him. I don't need to worry about anything. It seems like origin creatures summon all the other dinos in the area. Between you can hear that noise, it is my ice cream van truck. Oh, of course, he had to be in dead. Oh, for halfway. 
So yeah, this thing definitely kills a lot quicker, considering that the last time we tried killing a high level orange boss with a Giga, you were talking over 10 minutes and we're killing our second one in the space of like 3, I think it is. I really want to get as well guys, and it will be a video in the future, a mutated colour version of this Celestial Thyla. I don't know if it's possible, but we're going to try either way. Um, right, we've got some more Origin Blood, blood which is good, because we do need... Oh, so we've got some Fire Feathers, that's good. Ooh, did we get any more... Let's give us everything that we already have. Fire Mega Raptor, which we don't want, we want. Pretty sure there's another one over here somewhere. Look at all these freaking Thorn Dragons. What's that over there? Is that the Desert Tyrant? I think it could be, you know. The Gacha, we need to tame up some of them at some point. Just to get resources from. Alright, we're gonna go out here because we're gonna check out the Desert Titan. Oh, there it is. It's actually the only one that I've not killed yet. Uh, how powerful is it? 250k health. I think I can just bomb that with this. If it reaches, that is. It with a melee and kill it at one. What the hell's that? I don't like it, whatever it is. There we go, we're out of it. And we killed the Desert Titan. Wow, that is a nasty move. I want to farm it though. I'm going to farm it. Oh, there we go. Oh. That sneaked up on us. Right. Is there anything else that wants to have a dig at us? I don't think there is. I honestly don't know what loot we've got, because I don't really see anything come off that Desert Titan, which is a bit disappointing, but you know. Alright, we need more fire. So, let's have a look. Where are they? Seems like the this thing just chooses one at random, rather than the next closest, which... Actually, we've got one there, one there, so let's go there. I don't know if you get... I don't think you get the feathers off fire wyverns. Wouldn't make sense considering that they're a lizard. Or a reptile. Whatever. I don't know. They're one of them. I just realized that I am in desperate need of water. Oh, sorry, Argy, but you're gone. Is that were a vulture? Really? Oh, what's that? What is that? Oh, it's a, is it a Griffin car? It is. Level 560 as well. Oh, ice. Yep, we need ice feathers. Is that another one? It is. Oh, uh oh. That's not good. That's, that's really bad. Kill it before it freezes us again. Thank you. What's that? Oh, it's an alpha griffin. Can't kill that apparently. Well, 
12 million. What did I do 12 million to? That's a noxious river. Enforcer. What the hell is that? Oh, noxious. Terror bird. So we've got some ice feathers now. Um, oh, some more electric feathers would be nice. Thank you. Ooh, what's this? Oh, I'm just an alpha raptor. That's a U-tip. What's this? I don't know, but I like it. Oh, is it a light? What was it? Oh no, we're an ice griffin. That was a cool looking ice griffin. You're telling me that you can't climb up the earth, Tyler. Should be able to. Come on. Like, this is just ridiculous how you can't climb up this. Ooh, what's that? Ah. I think is a legendary Pegasus and a demonic Equus. Oh, no, that were an alpha. That's a legendary Pegasus. Which again, at some point, I do want to tame one. I feel like we've got a lot of resources here today. I'm quite happy about. Them. So yeah, you can climb vertical walls, but not anything else, which is a little bit backwards in my opinion. What's this? Alpha Turbo! You are not worthy of my time. What's that buff in the tower? You deal instant, take less. But your stamina is draining. Oh, I've just realised I have. I just realised you can activate. Oh, there's another ice. After that, we're after the fire one. What other ones do we need? There's fire, ice, electric. Am I missing one? I don't think I am. Fire, ice, electric. Really? Really? Pull me, Scorpiono. Oh, there we go. We've got primal, Kentro. Oh no, we're in Apex. I'm so misleading some of these colours. Ah, that's what made that noise. That was a uh, Celestial Griffin. Alright, let's have a look at what we've got. Yeah, I've got 135 electric feathers, which is nice. 36 fire feathers. I think we've got some back at base anyway. 143 ice feathers. And the rest is just uh, the standard loot that we get. Um, some more stuff over here though. That looks like we can kill. Oh my god, what is that? Oh, it's my limit. It's been frozen. Ah, funny. What the hell is that? Did that pick some at all? Can we kill the ice archer thingy, please? Thank you. Oh, it's an, it was an ice, ice mega raptor. Alright. Right, let's go back to base. See what we've got. Get some demonic kibble made. And then that way we are ready for the next episode, guys. 
I only really need to be able to make a couple of each kibble, both demonic and light. And then it's a case of just finding... Let me just grab off him feathers. Uh, where did I put feathers? Oh, so there is, there is caustic feathers, which I did not realise. Hmm. Let's, oh, what's that? Celestial soul. Right, that all of them? Right, so let's have a look. Demonic kibble. There it is. We've got enough to craft one, which is good. What about five? Apparently, yeah, we've got enough to craft five. Oh no, we've only got enough to craft three because of the caustic feathers. I think three is a good starting point. Primal blood. Primal blood. Yeah, I think we've got literally everything apart from the caustic feathers. What about light kibble? Is that a thing or is it... Hmm. Just have a look at what kibble there are. We've got demonic, celestial, fabled. Ah, this is the only thing that a dark or light dino will eat to be tamed. Ah, okay. So what's more powerful, dark or light creature? Or I'm getting so confused. Either way, we need more caustic feathers, um, but I can grab them. In between the next episodes, just so that we are up and good to go. But that means I didn't even realise they were dark creatures. I thought they were demonic. Let's have a look. Okay, so yeah, you got dark feather like that. Ah, right, so it seems like they are literally the counterparts to the light creatures. Again, they won't be too difficult to tame, especially considering that we now have um, some more origin bullets. Uh, we have enough to craft two more of them. We do, yes we do. Beautiful. Right, so we've got three now, which is perfect. Now that means in the next episode we can tame a demonic, a dark and a light creature. Um, considering that we've got the Thyler, it should run pretty smoothly, I'm hoping. Um, of course, the goddamn... Bronto's being attacked by a... Toxic Dodo. <laughs> His top is slowly going up as well, which is funny. Alright. But yeah, guys, that is going to be it for this episode. Um, it's more of a preparation episode, I suppose. But we are getting there, like, we're getting to the point now where the creatures we've got are powerful enough to start summoning the bosses. The only thing we're going to have to do is start looking at what sort of materials we need to sum summon the bosses. So if we go to here, boss summoners. We don't want tier 2. Tier 2 is just origin, which again, we know we can really take on. Um... So here, these are the two that we want to be looking at doing, which again means that we are going to be definitely to do the origin bosses anyway. Two lots of them, really. Um, some of them we've already got, like the Diabur, the Kairuku, the Kano, the Raptor. It's the Rex, Spino, Wyvern and Argent that we um, don't really have. Mainly because I don't know how powerful they are, but we are going to do summons with them and uh, hopefully test the Celestial Thyler on them. Now, we are going to have to tame a Celestial Allosaurus because they have an ability that forces flyers to land. Oh, well, stops them from flying, basically. And that will come in what the actual feck. I don't like how close that is to my base, wherever it is. So, let's just have a look around. That noise basically means that there's a celestial or a griffin corn nearby to the base. 
which if it wanted to could quite easily cause me a lot of problems. But where did it come from? Talk about getting distracted guys. No, this this just happens all the time. Right, let's have a look, see less deal. Right, okay, so there's Celestial Argent over that way. And uh, what about Griffin? Corn. Right there. Yeah, interesting. So, yeah, it can't be. It must have been that one that's like that Celestial Argy that's all the way over there. Um, but again, I'm not going to worry too much about that because it is a bit of a distance away from our base. What is this? Noxious Orvis, as if that's even worth my time. Fairwood creatures are always worth killing. Look through and kill all these guys. Just gets rid of them. Right, guys, um, and on the night that it is. On the note that it is now night time, look at how awesome the Celestial looks. We will be seeing you in the next episode. Hope you've enjoyed watching, and I'll see you next time.